New this morning, GE getting ready to flip the switch to help you power up your electric car. News 8's Kent Pierce live in Plainville with all the details. Good morning, Kent. Good morning, Chris and Chris. And when it comes to electric cars like the Chevy Volt here, there's sort of a chicken and the egg problem. People don't want to buy the electric cars until there are plenty of places to plug them in and charge them. And companies don't want to build the charging stations until there are more electric cars on the road. But here in Plainville, where GE Energy has a plant, they're going to solve that problem. They're opening up all these new charging stations here in the parking lot later today. Now, these are where you can just pull up plug in your electric car right into there. Now, this is not just a charging station, however. Anybody can build that. This is GE Energy, so they've got an extra twist to this. On the roof covering this area, there are solar panels up there, and those provide all of the power for the charging station. So not only are you saving the environment by driving an electric car, but the power for it also comes from the sun. Good news because gas prices these days are a little bit down, but still historically very high as we head into Memorial Day. 4.15 is the, is the average statewide for a gallon of regular gas right now. If you're driving an electric car, you don't have to worry about that. No complaining about gas prices, just the odd complaint about not enough places to charge your car. However, here in Plainville, they are fixing that today. They flip the switch on these charging stations at 10.30 this morning. The governor is going to be here as well as officials from GE to do that. Live in Plainville, I'm Kent Pierce, News 8.